who's back? Yo, what's what's going on, lads? Um, it's been a while. It's been nearly three years now since I've made a YouTube video, and um, I'm kind of excited to get back into this making things. Um, it is lockdown number two. We are in twenty twenty with COVID nineteen being a big impact on the year, and um, not being able to do pretty much anything. So, gyms are closed currently for the second time this year, which is fucking depressing. But thankfully, um, Evan, my cousin, um, he's got a couple of things over in the house. I've been training over there the last couple of days. Um, we are currently two weeks into a six-week lockdown, which is happening from um, the start of November to the end of November, basically, so we can all have a decent Christmas, I think. Um, yeah, so today what I'm going to do is I'm going to run you through what I eat and how I train during lockdown um, so it wasn't the same first lockdown first lockdown i didn't train um i barely like stuck to plan like a, any kind of fucking decent food I was pretty much eating shit but as of right now i mean coached by dave hardry so um we are on an actual plan and training is essential pretty much so um, we're getting in sessions as much as possible um, so yeah I'm gonna basically this is the breakfast so we've got three bagels three slim bagels there's four bacon medallions in there um, and then just a glass of orange juice um, sometimes I would throw in a banana um, but the ones that are there are just shit um, and I am not arsed going to the shop before I have breakfast so I will catch up with you guys after I've eaten this and let you know what I'm doing for the rest of the day. Right lads, what's going on? We're back. Bit of time has passed. Let the food kind of go down. I'll be getting into my next meal now soon. Um, I just kind of chill for a little while. Um, I am, since last, basically recording, I've gotten like heavily into uh, shoes, um, hype shoes. Like, I don't own very much. Like, I own a, one pair of Yeezys, one pair of Jordans. I just ordered a pair of Jordan 5 top threes. Um, they should be here in a couple of days, but I'm trying to sell a couple of pairs too. So if these aren't sold by the time this video goes up, um, just fucking throw me an offer in the comments or whatever. Um, if you're a UK ten, that is right. So I am trying to get rid of these bad boys here. Uh, the orange Air Max One anniversaries, um, in the size ten. They're pretty good condition, barely worn. Um, any any kind of offer at all? I mean, I paid. 150 farm so I'm not, I know I'm not gonna get anywhere near that Um, as for these as well 97s in um, pretty good condition once again size 10 um, throw me an offer um, so basically now all I'm gonna do take a couple of photos of these I can post them on some Facebook pages um, and see if I can sell them Um, that's kind of what I've been doing over lockdown as well it's just like buying shoes wearing them for a little bit and then selling them again just because I like my shoes. So uh, I'll show you the next meal then once I have it. So I'll talk to you guys in a few. So that's the next meal. 80 grams of oats, 300 grams of water, milk, low fat milk, um, two scoops of whey, and two squares of dark chocolate mixed in on it. It's amazing. So we have just finished up meal number two. Um, I have to wait until around seven o'clock to train um, today because, you know, I have to go under the big man's fucking orders. And yeah, I can't go to his house until like seven o'clock. Um, so it is now around four. Um, and I'm gonna go for a slight little walk before getting in my po or my pre-workout meal. Um, so on plan, I have to get around fifteen thousand steps in, um, and I haven't left the house today. So I'm gonna go for a walk for like an hour and a bit, uh, get as many steps in as possible. Then I'm gonna have to walk to his house as well afterwards and walk back. So we should be able to clock up our steps. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go for a walk down on the beach now. Um, seeing as you know, five kilometer radius and that, so um, we can't go anywhere outside of Tremor technically. But look, we're gonna go for a walk on the beach. 
there's nothing fucking wrong with it. Delighted to have it on my doorstep, so hey, let's go. Right, we're back. I had a little nap after my walk, I'm not gonna lie, I had a little lie down, um, and just kind of rested for a bit, but pre-workout meal, 200 grams of chicken, two normal vehicles, and I'm gonna throw a little bit of barbecue sauce on it. Um, we might get a can of Monster in the shop or something like that. Uh, today is an upper day, so I'll run you through that once we get there. Um, so we're gonna get through this now, and I'll catch up with you. Right, lads, workout section of the video. Um, starting it off at a bench press. Um, trying to keep the, the reps as slow and controlled as possible here. Um, not really rushing through things. This is one uh, actually my back off set here. Um, using 60 kilo. A top set I would do uh, 70 kilo at the moment for about 12 reps or so. Um, this one I was kind of fatigued, so I wasn't actually able to get out the, the 15 that I wanted. Um, but yeah, keeping it nice, controlled, and uh, just properly working the muscle instead of just throwing up weight. And uh, as we get on here now to bent over rows, same principle applies here, controlling the weight, not throwing it up um, like I do on my second set here, you'll see in a second. Um, I should have kept it slower to be fair, but um, here we're working with 90 kilo on a working set, and uh, I believe my back off is 70. Um, we don't really have that much plates over um, in Emmons house, so we're just kind of working on what we can. Um, so yeah, here's 70 kilo, obviously going way too fast here, um, but uh, yeah, that's the, the last clip I had. Right lads, workout done, only recorded the two compound movements, uh, bench press and bent over rows, um, as I just like, didn't want to have to constantly focus on recording something, I was trying to just get through the session, didn't have much time, so yeah, uh, you saw bent over rows was the second uh, exercise there. Um, Today was my second upper session of the week, um, so tomorrow will be a rest day, thank fuck. Um, so we're going to relax a little bit tomorrow. Um, but yeah, getting into the last meal of the night, so we have here 100 grams of uh, Cocoa Pops with milk in it, uh, 300 mils of milk. Um, then we have a protein shake, two scoops of Optimum Nutrition, a double rich chocolate. It's fucking amazing, I'm not gonna lie. And then two Rice Krispie Square Bars, which tops us off at 3,400 calories for the day, um, which is usually what I eat on a training day now. And rest days I eat about 2,900 calories or so. Um, but yeah, uh, I'm just gonna sit back, relax, have this, and uh, I'll catch up with you after that, just for a little chat. Right lads, um, back again. Just after finishing up the meal, I've been kind of watching YouTube videos for a bit as well, kind of just uh, trying to like see what I like watching, just so I can post stuff that I like watching as well. Um, and as for that, um, I just want to ask a question, basically, what would you like to see? Is there any kind of like um, informative videos you want to see, maybe, um, on the likes of training, uh, nutrition? I'm not qualified. Don't hold me to the shit I might say, but I'm going on based off of what I've learned from other people. Um, if you want to see some things like that, let me know. If you want to see some challenge videos, some fucking skits, any like anything like, um, I just kind of want to keep myself busy over lockdown, um, and see where this goes. So, um, I will catch up with you next week. Um, we'll be starting off with just a video a week or so. I'd say, um just trying to make myself more comfortable in front of the camera again because it's been a while so uh, yeah uh, I appreciate you watching if you got to the end of the video here um, if you did enjoy it really appreciate it if you left a comment and liked the video um, so uh, yeah once again guys I'll see you in the next one take care of yourselves goodbye